is going on guys George here today we're back in Revhead. Um, in the last episode that we did I just bought this car it starts barely it, it's running you can hear it squeaking it smokes real bad so we we built basically built like a little tow truck if you didn't see an episode you should go watch it because I'm getting ready to show you the tow truck so go watch it right now all right I don't know why it took so long to load right there. All right, so basically this is their tow truck. And now this is uh, this is my uh, Dodge Challenger, Dodge Challenger. And then we have, I guess it's kind of like I think it's kind of like an Austin Martin type looking vehicle. I mean, I don't think it'd be. I think it looks like what DB whatever it is. I don't know. It's got off-road truck tires, so we got air truck over here. I think we're actually going to sell it. Want to? Take it apart because I do like it, but it's just not what we want. So I feel like we need to at least take the motor out. <laughs> Let's take the motor out, or at least some of the parts off the motor because the carburetor very hard to find. All right, so let's go ahead. See the carburetor's new. I want to remove it because I know I need that. Actually, we'll remove like all these parts. Cause a lot of these parts are hard to come by because you have to go through the, the basically like the train journal and basically everything on this truck was almost brand new except for the starter so we're taking everything off that's new and I'm going to keep so we're going to do that let's go ahead and remove the motor remove the transmission and then I guess we'll let's move the dash cluster because that's usually a pretty good amount and the steering thing and the rear end because well we just need to all right so we did all that I think we'll go ahead and sell the truck like it is now it probably yeah it's it's like sixteen hundred dollars we we did it so let's see if we have eight thousand dollars in parts like it was shown um, the dashboard that's let's see well, the dashboard and this is almost three thousand dollars right there difference box let's go ahead and get rid of that there's another dashboard. We've got a lot of stuff we need to get rid of. We get rid of the battery. Keep the cover. Drive shaft will sell. The exhaust will go ahead and sell. Fuse box sell. Gearbox. How? Why do we have so many daggone gearboxes? Uh, generator. We'll go ahead. And we'll keep the generator. All the new stuff we will keep. Uh, if we fix it, how much is? Well, there's basically our four thousand dollars back. Here's another motor. We'll go ahead and sell it. Um, radiator will sell. I'm trying to keep the good stuff that we want to keep. We'll sell all this. That's pretty good back on money, though. If you think thermostat, we'll keep that because a lot of this is like you could take the parts and like it's they're like universal. You can put them on different motors and stuff, and we want to do all that. So we are going to sell the off-road tires because I don't need them. Let's see, water pump, no, 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 no. So let's keep all this because I said right, we got forty-four thousand dollars. Holy crap! Because that's because we balling. All right, so let's bring out our little car again because we I, I think it's type car like the old school like yeah. All right. Let's select 277 horsepower when you. Alright, so now let's see. Let's put it up on a lift and see what we need to do with this thing. I really want to throw it a V8. But I don't know if we can. Let's go ahead and remove the motor. And is the transmission good? The transmission is now good. Yeah, see, I want to find just a racing motor. I don't know if we can put it in there or not. Brand new racing V8 engine, $11,000. Holy crap. Okay, we're going to buy. And it's brand new state, $11,000 Renos. Alright, so we bought that. Um, I really want to install it. Can I install it? Okay, here is this the motor. I just bought this motor. 
All right, we are putting a V8 in this little car. Holy crap, it's got a V8. This thing is going to scream. Make sure all this is good back here. <clears throat> all right, so now we need to install a carburetor. I have it. That's why I said I wanted to keep a lot of the parts. That way I don't have to keep buying them. Oil filter, we don't have an oil filter. Starter, we don't have a starter. I shouldn't do that. Um, generator, we have a generator. I think we've, yo, know, it has a dry belt on it too, so we're good there. Um, ignition, let's see. We'll shoot this one. I try to keep stuff because it gets kind of expensive when you have to go back and keep buying stuff. Especially if you got new, so when we take a lot off the cars, I always try to keep it. Uh, water pump, we have a new water pump. What? It's coming together. <laughs> Spark plugs. I know we have those. Let's see. I think the only thing we need now is oil starter. We we have oil, but we don't have an oil filter. You figured kind of live out. Okay. We need a oil filter, racing air filter. Um, use. Let's see. Oil filter, oil filter, oil filter. Uh, well, I, it's a racing motor though. It's like I don't know what what it would fit on. I don't know. We'll buy this one. Maybe it'll fit. And we'll buy a racing air filter. Uh, let's see. We need a starter. Just we just need like just a used starter. Starter, 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 starter. Electrics. I figured it'd be in here, wouldn't it? Fuel gauge, engine, complete carburetor. Hmm. We need a starter. I don't know. I might have to take one, <coughs> take one off my old car. Let's see. Hopefully, yeah. So I see that oil filter worked for was on another motor. It works for this. All right. So we need a starter. I feel like we're gonna have to let's rob one of my starters off of my cars. Um, let's see. I think I, I don't know if this one's got it or not. Do you have a starter that I can rob car? This car will be fixed up eventually. It's one of my parts cars that I take. Oh, I don't have a starter back on it. Piece of crap. Let's see. Let's go back and find one. Are, are they some now? I see use ignition for... I don't need that. I need a daggone freaking starter. I don't care if it's for. I'll buy it. Speedo, tack, used headlights, fuel gauge, tail lights, sparks, uh, spark plug, duh. Uh, tack on it, I need a freaking, I'm about to buy a car just to get the starter off of it, but I don't know if it'll be good or not. There's another car, I don't even know if we can even have another vehicle. I don't think we have one of these yet, this car right here, so I think I'm going to buy it. Alright, so let's go ahead and bring this car in and take the starter off it. <clears throat> Alright. It looks like I don't I don't know. It's it's orange. It looks like a gigantic skittle. Looks like a like a crown vic. Alright, hopefully. Please have a starter that works. Starter, starter. Broken. Can I fix it? No. What the? Well, I mean, we can... I can remove it for right now, and then I can, like... Buy another one for the other car. Alright, this is actually going to be uh, a car that we... Say, like, just buy them and sell them and stuff, but... We'll buy them and strip them out, but... It takes so long. This little car is going to have 500 on it, and we're going to push some more power out of it. Alright, one last look before I put this used starter on. Um, we don't, they don't have it. Jack, on, why don't you? Alright, let's put it up on here, and I guess we'll put the starter on. Because I really want to, ha I really want to start. Alright, so let's go ahead and 
throw it on. Starter, we have a, a broken one. Install. On like a $20,000 motor, we have a broken starter. It sounds good. I don't know why it takes so long to rev up for. Everything is brand new on this motor. Every Well, except for the starter. Everything's new, like 100%. Well, except for that. I bought an air filter. Yeah, let's install that. Alright, so is the exhaust good on it? Fix the steering. It's like we're going to go all out with this car. Alright, fix. Fix. I guess we're going to shocks. And we're going to get rid of these old, ugly tires. Fix this. This car is going to be like awesome. Fix the fan. Alright. So let's take her out for a little span. See how it does. We'll, we'll pump the tires up first. Alright. Make sure the battery is charged. Uh, we've got water. We've got oil. Pump the tires up. Make sure they're good. Let's hit the road with it. Yes. Oh yeah. Come on. Oh yeah. Oh, I bet this thing's gonna be a monster. Oh it's still it's it's oh yeah, this thing's gonna be a monster. We actually might need drag tires for this. Look at that. Holy crap, this car is, it, it only has four gears, like I'm wide open. Okay, so we know we're going to neutral drop this sucker. I was like, can we, can we do a burnout is a question. Apparently we won't do a burnout, but we can probably do a heck of a donut. Bam! Alright, so we, let's go get us some tires. I feel like we need to run drag slicks on this thing. It would go good. But I want to... We, I think we only have, like, dirt racing. That's all we can do right now. This car is going to eat them alive. Alright, so let's find us some good tires. I want, like, wide, like, stanced out tires. 340 by 20 inch alloy rims. That sounds like something we could do. But we need to find wide 250. I need some like wide tires. What? what are... Brand new. Let's try these. I don't know if they're going to be wide enough or not, so I hope they are. Um, jack this thing up and take the tires off of it. Alright. Hopefully the rims are wide enough. But we only got two. For a thousand dollars we only got two rims. Oh my god, look. That thing is going to be sick. Okay, here's the question though. Can I put these wide rims up front too though? Because I was wanting to do like wide rims in the front. Like all the way around. Because if not, I think it's going to look stupid if we can't. Probably looks stupid if we do. Holy crap. Look at this thing. Look. Oh, God. Things will be... Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, my God. That's going to look great. All right. So, let's go back to tra uh, the paper. Let's see. We had, what was it? Three, three, forty. I guess we're going to have to buy some... We're probably going to have, like, two extra rims. I should have just bought these. Two pieces slightly used. Ah, it'll be alright. Alright, so we got those. I need some tires. They're 340 by 20, so we need some 20 inch wide tires. I don't want off-road tires. I want drag slick tires, but I don't know if that would fit. Almost some, like street tires. I think it'd be better. Let's see. Off-road tires. I don't want those. 
245.20 slicks. I mean, we can use that for now. Uh, including for sure, why not? Alright. Oh, yeah. This thing's going to be awesome. I can't wait to see what this looks like. This will be great. Alright. We got these. What? How can they not be installed on there? Let's take them back off. Sometimes it's like it's all googly boogly. Alright, let's remove them. Alright, so we got our 340 inch rims. I'll put this on. What? It's. It's. Why won't it fit? Are you telling me I just wasted like 600 and some dollars? Probably so. I waste a lot of freaking money on here. I used to like 20s. That's what it was. What's the drag stick tires? Was that? I bet we're gonna have to get these. Probably have to get this rim and the drag tires. Probably so. Yep, that's what we have to do. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this rim on. Oh yeah, dude, that thing's awesome. I wish this car was full of drive. This thing would be a monster. All right, let's go ahead and install the drag tires. So we're going to have, to have some more tires. So we're going to have, to have drag slick tires. All right, look at that. Oh my gosh, this thing is insane. It's like I hope it's still turned. Yeah, like the tires in the shock and the motor. Holy crap, it's, oh, I was going to say, the shock's are moving, but never mind. I love that. Alright, let's go ahead and remove this. And remove this. Alright, I need to find me some more big tires. I need some more, like, slicks. 245.40s. I need 340s, apparently. 340, oh, that's rims. Drag slick tires. I what? I need some more. Um, dang. What should that be like the worst tires in the world to find? All right. Apparently, apparently we're not going to find any right now. So I guess what we're going to do is, since we bought that one vehicle, I'm going to go ahead and put just regular like. I'll put the regular rims on it. We ain't going to have no tires on it right now. But it'll give you a little sense of what I'm trying to go for. We'll, we'll do like a cool little paint job. Everything. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, dude, that thing is awesome. And the best thing, V8. I need a better starter, I think. Oh yeah, after it gets out of that missing phase and stuff, we're good. Alright, so let's put this up and let's go get a vehicle, old Crown Vic, whatever it is, and basically we're going to sell it. Buy and sell stuff here. Well, basically we just like demolish it. Alright, let's see. We can take the motor out, we can like sell the whole entire motor. Fix and remove. That'd be a good part. I think I'm only going. Well, it's like I was only going to remove like certain parts. But I mean, come on. It's like well, you make so much money. Money. It's like after this, we should be up to thirty thousand again. Hopefully, if not more. All right, we'll do the fuse. Remember, some of the best things to get is like the dash cluster, because that's at least a thousand. Remove this, and it's like we can race too. Like we're gonna race. It's like I want to build that little car to race because the other car doesn't seem like I don't know. That little car is like will be. That little car is gonna be quick. All right, so I'm not worried about anything else. Let's go ahead and sell it for five sixty, and let's go here. Let's see the dashboard. Over a thousand dollars differential. If I fix it, so we got a little extra exhaust sell fuse box fix. Alright, let's see. 
Check it out. Okay, it's $3,300. $280. We make a little money out of it. Um, let's go ahead and sell it. We'll sell the radiator. Rims. Two hundred. I don't... I guess we can use that for something else. Now, I don't, I don't want to get my daggone... My, uh... Box too full, because then I keep forgetting the parts and stuff. So apparently I have nothing that these will fit. These slick tires. So we'll go ahead and get rid of them. And... We'll keep the radiator and that stuff. Okay, so we're back up to $38,000. Not too shabby, if you ask me. Um, I really need a freaking... Freaking tires, man. Those won't work, those won't work, those won't work. I don't know when, like, they redo them or anything. What are... Nah, uh, two is five. I need three forties. Or at least some more drag slicks. All right. Well, there goes that. So, I guess what we'll have to do now is see what we can buy and fix. We got an old truck. We done need an old truck. Hmm, I'm trying to figure something, buy something that we haven't really done. Huh. I don't know. I really, I really just, I really want to get this up. So we might have to take the wheels and stuff. Look at that thing. I think it's just like sick looking. All right. I think we'll go ahead and show. I want to put all new parts and everything on because this is going to be like a, a project. Let's go ahead and pa uh, fix the body. Give it better boost. Now let's go ahead and I want to paint it. Let's do black. We can do, yeah, let's just do black. Do we want? I thought about doing like a a white top on it, like black, and then like a white top. At least for, nah, I don't know. I kind of I kind of like the all black though. But all black works. All right. Let's go ahead and give it a wash. Okay. Oh, I'll tell you, do you just wash it and rinse it clean? All right. Let's go ahead. We should put like I don't know something cool up here. But I'm gonna strip this thing basically all the way down, and we'll, we'll build it from scratch. But we'll probably just strip it down real fast, and in another video we'll do it. We'll do it and stuff. Let's see. Let's go ahead and do it this way. I want to move everything. It's like I want everything. I just basically want to build it from scratch myself. I, even if the parts are good, I just want to do it myself because I think about, like, hey, I rebuilt it. Plus, it gives you knowledge about how like the game works and everything. And because I'm not messing with any of the suspension or anything like that. Is this like racing stuff? Okay, we might just go ahead and fix and. We'll get rid of all that right now. Okay. We'll keep the steering. The box is good. We'll get rid of the motor. Rid of the horn. I wish we had to get like inspection stickers. This is like. I wish they put a little bit and made this like my summer car. Then this game would be like the greatest game in the world. Now we'll go ahead and take the exhaust off of it. Alright. And the transmission. You were coming out. Alright, so basically all we got is the battery. That's all we got. We ain't got no headlights. We do have tail lights. But that is it. Alright, so let's get our other car out. I know I switch back and forth a lot, so I apologize for that. The I really want to get this thing on the road. This is like the the classic I don't know. This might try to be my favorite part. But I need some freaking racing slicks, man. Alright. We have, like, no 20s. I need, like, another set of the... No. Yeah, I need another set of the drag slicks. We might just have to put, like, different set of rims on right now. You know what? That's what we're going to do. Let's go ahead and jack it up. And we'll put smaller wheels in the front. I'm actually going to take this, remove, and I'm going to put that one back here, and then we're going to put the other one 
the other other thing right there and then we'll remove that and then I will install what I thought we had I thought I had like a, a ton of rims and tires and stuff that we took off the other car we do oh I can't put those rims on here okay apparently we gotta buy that sucks we gotta buy a set of rims and tires just for that uh, doo -doo -doo. let's see 24520 can we find some 24520 let's buy this and 245 tires that sucks that I had to just buy that 245 rims and style it probably be a different style now it's basically the same but I don't know I kind of want them all the same all the way around 245 20 well at least we got four tires with it see how they're a little bit not as wide I want the wideness I think that's pretty cool so let's put this on and 245 20 install. Let's put your tire on it, yeah. And we put a tire on. And we should be ready to go. Let's go ahead and drop it down. Alright. Let's take it outside and try it out. <coughs> so crazy looking. Holy crap, did you see that? Oh, this thing might pop a freaking wheelie. There's no way. If this thing pops a wheelie, we'll lose it. Holy crap, it wants to go. Look at that. We would totally win a race with this. Well, the only thing is, it's like I think I need like off-road wheels. Oh my god, this thing is wicked fast. Holy crap. Oh God. Ah, what if I can get like a better transmission for it that has better gears instead of the one that I have in it now? That's actually something to think about. Pop it a willy. Holy crap, that is awesome. I can't believe it done that. Wet lanes too. All right, guys. If you enjoy this video, make sure you hit that like button. Uh, I really will be working on this car some more. We might try putting a different transmission in it and stuff right now because we do have a pretty good amount of money. But I hope you enjoyed the video. If you could give us a like, make sure you punch that subscribe button, and we'll be back for more videos of this because hopefully I do some updates. But once we get this car tuned in, we're going to take it to the dirt track and run it and win. We are number one. <laughs> Anyways, guys, this is George and. I'm